and the second deputy governor of the Bank of Ghana, Dr. Elsie Awaji, has announced that the central bank is determined to continue providing support through policy making for to promote domestic economic growth processes in a COVID-19 era. Addressing the media during the 2022 edition of the Money Summit, the Deputy Governor of the Central Bank, L.C. Awadzi Ado, emphasized the need for governments across the continent to see prevailing global challenges as a wake-up call to come up with indigenous policies tailored to the needs of Africa. She says the pandemic and the recent geopolitical war has reinforced the role of prudent microeconomic policies in positioning economies to better withstand economic shocks and global supply chain vulnerabilities. Hence, the recent happenings is a wake-up call for the continent to think outside the box, build on our strengths and address our vulnerabilities now rather than later. She also hinted that this process requires concerted effort of all stakeholders, national and regional authorities, public sector and private sector to change Africa's economic story for good. The second deputy governor of the Bank of Ghana added that the central bank will continue to provide strong policy support to promote domestic and regional economic growth recovery efforts and the drive towards building a more resilient and self-sufficient Africa through promoting intra-African trade within the African continental free trade area. 